to the skip. Coming to you live. Straight out of Real Six Aquatic Kennels. Just want to let you guys in on a little project I'm working on. Right before you are my Amphilopus Zadiosa, aka Arrow Cichlids from Lake Apoyo. I have this female and male in 110 gallon. I just placed a female in here a week ago just to test the waters. See how well they do together. See if he's going to be over aggressive with her or was he going to allow her to eat and swim around in peace. And so far, so good. Now, I'm making this video because now I notice her tube is down. It has dropped. Her belly is getting fat. And he is in his breeding dress, his breeding color now. He was barred just like she was prior to placing her in this aquarium. And now he's a, a gray grayish almost platinum like big grave digger at the belly and fin areas and of course she's sporting her dark bars so it looks like I'm gonna have a nice New Year's gift from these two I'm thinking they're gonna probably drop by New Year's Let's see if I can do a feeding video as well. If I could drop some food in there. Oh, I think, I don't, I think his back is turned. With a male. Of course, he turned around quickly. Let's drop some more in there. Female is getting hers as well. A very good sign. This species is on the endangered species list. I don't know if some of you guys may know, some of you guys may not know, but currently on the endangered species list from Lake Apoyo is the Xyliosum Earl and the Chancho. Most of those species in that lake are on the endangered species list. So I feel that I will be making a contribution to the species survival if these two were to mate successfully and I distribute their offsprings throughout the hobby. Thank you for watching. The skip.